That's the World Economic Forum for you. The WEF is often described as a group of supervillains, but they're also hilariously idiotic. Not just evil, buffoonish. And by the way, they know it. They're smart enough to be embarrassed anyway. The WEF has since deleted its tweet about COVID lockdowns. It has memory hold its promotion of scammer Sam Bankman-Fried. It has conveniently forgotten all about its guidance on Sri Lankan fertilizer, on which it turns out the WEF is not an expert. None of that ever happened. The slate is clean. So we're ready for yet another World Economic Forum annual meeting in Davos, Switzerland, which is underway right now. The event kicked off this week with 84-year-old Klaus Schwab, he's the founder of the WEF, promising to, quote, master the future. We couldn't meet at a more challenging time. We are confronted with so many crises simultaneously. What does it need? to master the future. I think to have a platform where all stakeholders of global society are engaged. Hmm. Brianna, in honor of the World Economic Forum happening right now in Davos, what would be your favorite insect meal? Plate of, plate of crickets? Crickets are supposed to be legitimately good. What, like, do you, what do you put them on? Honey? Peanut butter? Um, I think the idea of kind of roasting them so they're crispy with like a, a salty, hot, kind of seasoning would be ideal to me. I don't like the idea of sweet chocolate dipped crickets. That, that doesn't appeal to you me. You know me, I hate spice, no spice. <laughs> I don't know that about you, but I am not surprised to learn <laughs> that about you. <laughs>